Hey, hi friends, welcome to another session of Many Talks. Yes, good morning. What I'd like to show this morning is using the Sione One actually to build up a mesh system. In other words, if I want to repeat a data package. Now, normally I would have a transmitter, TX here, and somewhere on the other side, I would actually have my RX, my receiver. In this case, transmission, perfect, no problem. But what happens if I don't actually get across to the opposite side and my signal ends here? What I can do is simply install an A repeater or a number of repeaters. And depending on my setup, I can actually have a mesh system of repeaters. This would be the module which I'd like to take into operation. Right, in order to demonstrate this mesh, I'm going to put a number of repeaters in between. All of these I would configure as a repeat functionality. The TX would transmit. These guys would all sit somewhere in the field and do the job or alternatively repeat the signal. Now what happens if a simple repetition of a signal takes place? These guys would receive the package, all of them, and they all receive a package and say, right, have I transmitted this before? If no, I'll simply retransmit it. But what happens? This guy could transmit it that way, that way. he could transmit it this way, and even towards the third guy there. And already you'll see each of these receivers and transmitters would delay the package by a small fraction of a few milliseconds, and in fact, And you can see that we would probably have a number of collisions. Each repeater would then say, right, the package I've received, has it been repeated before? Have I received it before? That guy would say, I, I have had the package, I don't want it. This guy would say, I don't want that one, etc., and maybe that. So you reduce the number of packages and you don't retransmit. Each transmitter, each repeater would decrement a repeat counter. And in that way, you'd have a organized system. And ultimately, out of the packages received by my receiver, the receiver would check, have I had this package before or not? And right, this would be the valid one. That one would be the odd, odd one out. Right, in that way, I control my number of packages. I'd like to test this and actually put up a sniffer somewhere. Uh, stop, Manfred. Uh, what? A sniffer somewhere. So what I'm going to do is put a, a nice little sniffer somewhere here. Now the sniffer accepts and shows all received packages, all valid packages. So what would happen here is that the sniffer here would actually receive this package. Right, for Three repeaters, I could theoretically receive four packages and one valid package on the RX. This is the concept roughly, and I'd like to demonstrate that. Let's go to the laboratory and actually test this. Till later. All right, folks, I've set up my system here in the lab to actually test my Thaoni mesh system. And what have we got here? On the left-hand side, obviously connected to my computer, I have a Thaoni one which transmits on 2.4 gigahertz a standard proprietary package. So this is my transmitter. Here I have set up three repeaters. These repeaters here actually do nothing else than receive the package, delay it a little bit, and then retransmit it. And what they do, check whether they had it before or whether it's in a doubling. And on the right hand side here, we actually have number one, a Thaoni one set up as a sniffer, and I've connected this to the smart command on the left hand side. Now the sniffer should receive all packages, but secondly, I have one more module here. Our Thaoni one stick, which should then only receive one package, one valid package, because any doubling should be redundant. And this guy I've connected to my second package here. Right, I'm gonna send you a little hello world from my transmitter, 
We'll see what the repeaters are going to do with it, how they flood the system with the flooding mesh, and we'll see what happens on the reception side. Hello world. Right, here we see four packages received by the sniffer, and the normal for only one stick received one package only. Excellent. It just shows that our little flooding mesh actually seems to be working. Test it yourself. Have fun. Till next time.